Hello everyone, I'm here with a special guest, Omaha Westside senior Caleb Binning, and he has some news for us today. Husker Nation, I'm staying home, go Big Red. Caleb Binning commits to Nebraska. It's a pretty big commitment for Nebraska, and uh, in my opinion and others, the top player in the senior class in the state of Nebraska. Caleb, why Nebraska? Why staying home? Uh, first, uh, I'm a big fan of Matt Rule. Um, I like what he's doing, the direction, um, and just the way he carries himself. He's definitely a guy uh, I want leading me. And just staying home, um, you know, creating my own legacy. I know my dad went there, so there's the legacy talk, but creating my own legacy, I think, would be pretty cool. I want to touch on that. You, you, you're not going to Nebraska because your dad went there, or your dad's the play-by-play. -play. Let's get that out of the way. Clear that up for me. Like, you know, there's so much talk about that, but you're good enough in your own right. <laughs> so what was that process like, kind of fighting kind of in your mind uh, both option or both ideas, I guess? Uh, well, first uh, with the old staff, when I first started getting recruiting, um, it wasn't the most attractable place to go to. Um, no disrespect to that. Uh, coaching staff, but it, Nebraska wasn't super high up on my list and vice versa. I don't think I was super high up on their list too. So that gave me a chance to explore a whole lot of other schools. And when that new staff came in, it, they really had to connect with me and they couldn't just use the, your dad went here and stuff. So I think they did a really good job doing that. Yeah. Um, I do want to talk about legacy and your dad following in his footsteps. The number thing is well documented for you. Uh, the one and you like the two and you know it's a combination of his 21 and um, explain that for people that maybe don't know what we're talking about. So up until freshman year um, I wore 21 my whole life my dad obviously wore 21 and in high school I kind of wanted to break away from that number one I want to play wide receiver and 21 isn't really a wide receiver number so I stuck with number one in football and basketball I wear number two. Yeah just to pay homage to your dad, yes, right? Sir. Process, the process was long for you. You clearly took your time. Yep. Um, you could have committed a year ago. <laughs> you could have committed like months ago. Why now? Why today? And I guess why wait until the end of the regular season of your senior year? Um, I just, it just feels right. Uh, going, I missed uh, my junior season due to an injury. So just leaving it open to see if there's any new schools and what schools stuck with me. And I would say K-State, Iowa, and Nebraska really stuck with me. And so I limited, I limited it down to three and felt those three out and Nebraska felt like the right choice. So K-State, is Iowa, Nebraska, real regional. You didn't want to go too far from home? No, I did not. <laughs> I, I traveled a lot for basketball and it wasn't always my favorite thing. So I figured I'd want to stay pretty close. Yeah. yeah, family is very important to you. Obviously, we talked about your dad, but you know, mom's here, brothers, all of that. Um, grandparents and everything, they get to see you play. Yeah. Uh, how neat will that be? Uh, it'll be very interesting, you know. Uh, my grandma, she was very proud of me having a son that went to Nebraska. Um, she's very happy I chose to stay home, as are my dad's siblings. Yeah. So safety, right, is a position in Nebraska. What was Coach Coop's reaction when you told him? Uh, he was hype. Uh, he's usually an all, all business guy, all football, but he was super hype. And I think he was, he was excited because I know I could tell he worked hard to build a relationship with me. Uh, when we sat down in January and it's grown over time and we really see eye to eye on how we handle stuff and how we go about our business. Yeah, I guess we can go about your business. I mean, you went down there a lot of times that people don't know about to just chop it up film room type of things to know exactly what you were getting into, right? Yeah. How, explain that process and, and what went into that for you. Well, to me, that's like the day to day things, what you're going to get every single day. So I feel like it's really important. And uh, just to see how he coaches, how he talks about his players, how his players talk about him. That was very important to me. Coach Rule's reaction was? Uh, he's excited. He's very hyped to have me. Um, you know, they really wanted me from the start. And I could tell those weren't just words that he showed. Uh, he showed that with his actions. All right, everyone, that's Caleb Benning, the newest Husker.